Whoa, what are we opening up today? Is this a fucking bag of fresh meat? Well, if it can't be meat, it, it could it might be pocket monsters potentially. Hey, hey guys, how you going? I fucking forget what this is. I remember it looked old, I think, when I bought it. I got it a long time ago. It's been sitting sitting there with, like all my other shit. Yes. I know we're still doing this, but I feel obligated to take Pokemon breaks, or I'll be fucking burnt at the cross. Okay? Finishing that Yu-Gi-Oh thing next. App. Hoo-hoo. Let's see what we got here. I'm pretty excited. Alright, so it's wrapped in this. Anything in this? Nah, you fucking jip me. Come on, mate. Put a little present in there or something. I like bonus rewards. Wait a minute. Oh! I spoke too soon. I think this one is a bonus reward. I love you. I love you. The eBay legends that do these. I bet it's actually just something I've purchased. Oh, it, it totally is. Oh, it's part of it. <gasps> oh, so what is this? This is a poker card creator pack. W B W B Kids presents. So basically, um, it's full of. It's a booster pack. Inside are cards that are all the winners of kids aged five to fifteen in America. Who entered this back in the day by drawing their own cards. Their own designs for the contest. They sent them in and they sent out these booster packs. So the booster packs are, I think are made up of all the art of the, all the winners. But the amount of booster packs that were printed. Were every single person who entered the contest was sent a booster pack. Like here, thanks for thanks for entering. Here's a, here's a booster pack. Everyone who entered. So this has got history. This is <laughs> some kid's Booster pack. Sealed away, boys. Sealed away, girls. We're not we're not cracking into this. We'll see what it says in the back. Congratulations! You are holding a pack of Pokemon trading card game cards created by winners. Yep, I was correct. Of the kids WB Poker Card Creator Contest, where kids age 5 to 15, correct, submitted their entries to become the illustrator of a real Pokemon TCG game card. We hope you'll enjoy having them in your collection. Keep watching Kids WB for all new Pokemon battles and adventures. Very cool piece to add to my collection. Glad they've locked it away for me, otherwise I may have been tempted. What else do we have here? Oh shit, this looks old, dude. Back when Jinx was an African-American woman, before they changed her skin color. Back when Squirtle looks like he should have been aborted. Back when Pikachu hadn't hit the fucking gym. Back when the Diglett mystery still was- Oh, uh, well, eh, well, you know. He's got hair now, I guess. Uh-oh. Yeah, Fabio style. Do I want to open this? This... This seems like factory sealed still. Is this a VHS? Have I just got V- Is this all fucking purchased? Alright, well. <laughs> great opening. So far, uh... So that's pretty cool. It's in Japanese, Max, you fucking ape. Oh, oh, is this what we- Dude, do we better get some of this in this box. Alright, so it says- Oh man, where's fucking- Oh man! Where's Kohei when you need him? He's hit by that bus, I guess. <sighs> I guess he's translating cards in heaven now. Or wherever Asians go. Chinatown or something. Alright, so... The hell is this? Is some Japanese vitamins in here or something? I recognize the Chansey coin. Okay. This is fresh. I wonder how much I paid for this. Ooh, ooh. The Pokemon card tray. Oh! Surprise after surprise. Hope this doesn't have Kohei's address on it. So this is teaching you the basics. Dude, I think this video is straight up to teach you the card game. It's like a four kids VHS to teach you the game. All right, we've got, so we've got like this big fuck off mat. It's like double. Two two player sided. Oh, we did get the little Japanese gummies straight over the counter. They're of course actually uh, damage tokens, I think. We got the Chansey coin, but it's pink. Well, that's just insensitive, isn't it? Hiroshima. That was a big. I don't know what. 
what these people are like. Okay, so on the left side of the box, oh, oh, do we really dare? The left side of the box, <gasps> we have what appears to be some Pocket Monsters cards. Oh my god! Dude! Is this a special VHS set? With a special little list? Oh, man! This is so cool! They're like, um, reprints of these cards. Yeah, hold your titties, bitch. But they're, um, also in this corner. They're all numbered. So they're sort of just teaching you how to play. So I think, um, this side is a grass and psychic deck. Bulbasaur? Okay. <laughs> There's some lightning in there. I recognize that. This is some... There's a lot of weird art in this. Maybe this isn't as old as I think it is. I've never seen that artwork. Alright, it's a deck. Switch. I've never seen that either. He looks bored, though. Ah! The infamous yellow-cheeked Pikachu. Okay, so that's cool. It's kind of like a, um, it's a trainer sort of deck. It's a starter deck to teach you how to play. Two starter decks. Still think this is very, very old. So on the other side, we've got this one. Oh, this is going to be a water deck. Oh, baby! Isn't that the artwork for, um, like, Dark Blastoise? Or Team Rocket Blastoise? <gasps> oh, he's just, it's, it almost looks like a Bulbasaur. There's a magma. So it's water fire. There's a squirtle uh, headbutt in a tree, knocking some apples out. Everyone loves some tasty apples. That's that's like straight from the fucking English set. I haven't seen some of this stuff. What is that art? That's cool, man. That's the Arcanine. We've got a bunch of energies, obviously. You need them if you're playing the game. A very cute Growlithe. Let's just go hands shuffle sideways through these. Contemplating Squirtle again. Uh, I remember that Jigglypuff. Never seen that Sparrow. That's a cool War Turtle. Then we've got, I remember that guy, that Poliwag. I remember the rest of that, especially that Growlithe. What's strange to me is everything is numbered in this except this Blastoise, which has just got his normal number count. Very cool. All right, nothing too crazy uh, today. Just want to break up that Yu-Gi-Oh episode. I thought this was a pretty cool thing to open, though. Didn't realize I bought both these from the same eBay user. But I hope you guys did enjoy about uh, learning a few things, <laughs> exploring stuff. Uh, I'll probably have uh, a few more eBay relics and different packages sitting around I'm waiting to, to open with you guys. If you're interested in that sort of stuff, do let me know below. And if you'll excuse me, I've got some uh, quality entertainment to enjoy. I fucking miss Kobe.